You ever notice how sunglasses instantly boost your cool factor? Meta took that cool factor and slipped a whole digital display right into the lens. They've teamed up with Ray-Ban and dropped the Meta Ray-Ban display AI glasses, a classic Wayfarer style that hides a tiny full color display in your right lens. Yeah, it looks like regular shades until you realize it's basically a mini HUD strapped to your face. Quick thing before we go deeper, you know, if you're into future gadgets and like hanging out for these breakdowns, tap that subscribe button. You'll always be the first to know when the next crazy piece of tech lands. Alright, so what are we looking at? The glasses start at $799, and that price isn't just for the frames. Meta bundles in the new Neural Band, a wristband that picks up subtle muscle signals from your arm, letting you control the glasses without touching them. It's like giving your wrist Jedi powers, this makes it feel less like a gimmick, and more like Meta laying the foundation for true hands-free computing. From a style perspective, they nailed it. They look just like regular Ray-Bans, a bit on the bulky side, but still light enough to wear every day, and the display is built neatly into the lens instead of slapped onto the frame. That display is surprisingly sharp for its size, and it can show messages, navigation prompts, captions, or even act as a live viewfinder for the camera. But don't think of these as the final stage of AR glasses, they're more like a stepping stone. Meta has bigger plans with its long-term projects aiming for holograms, spatial computing, and digital objects that live around you. The Ray-Ban display is just the warm-up, getting people used to the idea of wearing tech on their face while still being stylish. Meta's timeline points to something more refined in the next couple of years, with 2027's Artemis glasses expected to finally bring full AR, lighter frames, better field of view, and holographic overlays that could replace your phone for good. The real sticking point right now isn't the hardware though, it's the software. Meta's OS feels closed off, which limits what developers can build for it, and that's where the competition steps in. Google is working on its own AR slash XR glasses, likely arriving in 2026, with a focus on utility, and more importantly, access to a massive app ecosystem. If Meta feels like a test run, Google could end up delivering a more practical daily driver. Snap is also cooking up new specs for 2026, rumored to mix displays and overlays with some lighter spatial features. Think of it as their attempt to finally bring Snapchat's AR lenses into the real world. Amazon is lining up its own smart glasses for late 2026 or early 2027, and of course, Apple is rumored to be on a similar timeline. Everyone wants a piece of the AR pie, and the next two years are going to be packed with announcements. So here's the big picture. If you want to be the one rocking futuristic shades before anyone else, the Meta Ray-Ban display is available this month. But if you're patient, waiting until around 2027 could mean sleeker designs, richer features, and maybe even more affordable prices thanks to the competition. Thanks for watching our video, stick around, hit that subscribe button, and we'll keep walking through the future together, one gadget at a time. Peace.